Massachusetts. Metro Police are looking for the driver who left a toddler critically hurt following a hit and run crash Sunday night. Yeah, police say a three year old was crossing Doolittle Street when a white van turned westbound onto Doolittle, striking her, then leaving the scene. Hades now reporter Sally Hermia live near MLK in Lake Mead. She spoke to the family and now shares more. Denise and Brian, this all happened just a few steps away from her home and tonight her family is still in shock. As for that three year old Tresher Breland, she is still in the hospital tonight. Around like 820, we was all outside. Uh, we were just having a little Halloween party for the kids. Why would you drive that fast no on Halloween on. with no lights on? LaLadra Edwards is Tresher Breland's on. She still can't comprehend why that driver didn't stop. We just hear a loud boom, like it sounded like he hit another car. Police say three-year-old Tresher was crossing Doolittle Street when a white van turned onto the street, hit the little girl, then drove away. We like, he hit one of the kids, he hit one of the kids, so we all start running. The driver stopped a little, but then went faster once he saw the adults. We don't know if it was a guy or a woman, but it was a, it was, it's like a big um, box van, like a, they said it's a Ford. So like it's a big box van, all white. It was some stuff flapping in the back of the windows. Edward says the street has a speed limit of 15 miles per hour. She says the driver was speeding her message to that driver. To the person who did it, you will be filmed. I mean, you can't even say it was an accident because why wouldn't you stop? You know what I'm saying? You just kept going. You didn't care. Out here live, Tresher is still in the hospital. As we just mentioned, she has gone through surgery and is expected to be okay. If you have any information on that driver, you are urged to call police. Sally Jaramillo, live, local now.